What's going on everybody, Stabs here, welcome back to another one of my videos. Today we're actually going to be doing a review on this new Red Dragon mouse, uh, which I actually ordered a couple days ago, it actually came to my house yesterday, and uh, without actually wasting any time, let's just get straight into the review. Alright guys, so this is the actual original box that came with the mouse, as you guys can see, it shows all of the details on here, so if you guys can actually see this right here, it says 2000 DPI, uh, 4000 frames per second, 15G ACC, super fast game engine, dirt smooth uh, Telon uh, feel pads, six function buttons, eight tuning weights, three quick changing DPI settings, and button durability 10 million clicks, which obviously means you can click this 10 million times until it stops working. Now, if you guys just turn the box to the side, you're going to see a warranty sticker here. I actually peeled it already, but you guys should just go ahead and peel that off. And you guys are going to see that this little strap actually comes off here. And next thing you guys are going to notice, there's actually four clips on here. One on, uh, two on each side, and then two more on these. So these are actually the ones that you can clip off easily. They easily come off. And uh, these two clips right here are actually really hard to actually get off. These are stronger to, to get into than my bank account. So what I actually did was I actually took a pair of tweezers. And if, um, all you want to do is basically just pry this little part off just pry it up and there you go so you see it pops up and then you don't even have to pop the other side um you could just basically take the whole lid off now you're actually first thing you see is this little um challenger technology limited thing that has nothing to do with this and the next thing you see is the mouse packaging is really really good and it's pretty simple let me just get that out of the way so, um, you guys can obviously see the cord, which is red and black braided. And another good thing is the USB connector is actually gold-plated, which is a lot better than regular plates. Um, so, there is really simple packaging. There's a little plastic part that just comes off. You can get rid of that. And the only other thing left in the box is the mouse itself. So, you guys can see, it's actually a really, really pretty mouse. Um, can't believe I actually just called this pretty, but you guys can see, like, it's obviously red and black. Um, that's the main reason why I ordered it. And you guys are going to see in a little bit when I actually do light, uh, plug this in. You guys are going to see this little part right here light up. So, I'm going to get this plugged in really quick and, uh, show you guys basically how it works. Okay, so you guys can see the mouse is actually lit up right now. You guys can see the little laser on the bottom and those little lights on the side that I was talking about. Um, you guys can see right there, it's a really, really, really nice mouse. Uh, the main reason why I actually ordered a new one is because the scroll wheel on my old one was actually starting to like wear off and it wasn't really scrolling all the way down uh, when I needed it to. Right here are the two uh, buttons you have on your left side right next to your thumb. You can click it like that. And then the two with this little part on your thumb. Uh, you actually also have a button up top which I haven't found a use for. I don't think I'm actually going to use these buttons too much because I'm not, I'm not really into gaming really much on the computer i just bought it just because it does look nice and uh my old one was starting to wear but you guys can see again i did talk about that braided cable red and black um does go really good with my new mouse pad I actually ordered with this so um it is pretty nice now you guys are going to be seeing this obviously from now on just because it is a new mouse um, you guys are actually probably wondering what this also sounds like, which I do really, really like. It is a new mouse, but then again, it also has like a very clack, uh, tactile click. So you guys are going to listen to this and um, let me know what you guys actually think about it. Another thing that actually came with this mouse was the little weights underneath. Now, this is actually also very hard to pry open. So, what I'm going to do is just use my tweezers again and just help twist this around. And basically, what you do is you just lift this little part up right here. You guys can see it starts to open. And you can just use your fingers at this point. And as you guys can see, let me just turn this over. Um, here you have, let's see, I think it was eight weights actually. So, it literally looks like a clip from like a magnum, which... Um, it's pretty cool. I haven't taken any out just because I like the way it feels, but if you can, you know, I just use my tweezers right here again. Um, you don't obviously need to use tweezers for this. I just find it a lot easier because my nails are completely trash. And uh, there's your weight. So it's pretty easy. I'm just going to put this back before I lose it. Um, like I said, I don't have any of them taken out because I like the way it feels. It's pretty heavy like this. And uh, I'm not really sure how much each weight is. 
but um, it is pretty nice. So, and then when you want to just put it back, you just, let's see, open, line those up, just like that. And then I'm going to use my tweezers again to just help twist this, and that's it. So that's basically the mouse you guys see. Like I keep saying, it's a very nice mouse. Um, if you guys do have any questions about it, just let me know in the comment section below. And I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please like, comment, subscribe. Follow the stream links down in the description below. And I will see you guys next time. Peace out.